So hello everyone welcome to my youtube channel i hope you guys are doing great and today's video i'm going to talk about how we can use the mix mamo for animating our own character so right now on my screen here you can see we have a little bit animation into our character and which is i have created with the help of the mix mamo animation basically so in this video we are going to talk about how we can do this whole process we'll talk about how we can import and export all the animation and all the files from blender to mix mamo and mix mamo to again blender so now let's start the tutorial so first of all what i'm gonna do basically i'm just gonna delete this existing animation file because we don't need it right now and we'll just uh, move this character into our center basically something like that and i'm just gonna select my whole character and first of all we need our character file into our abx format basically so what i'm gonna do basically i'm just gonna export uh, not basically uh, yeah i'm just gonna export my file into our abx and i'll just give this name as a man yeah something like that and export it all right after that i'm just going to move it a little bit side because we'll again import the same character which is we will uh like bring from the mix mamo but with animation also okay so let's start the process now okay so now what i'm going to do basically i'm just going to my browser so right now here you can see guys i'm into my browser and here you can see um this is a mix mamo website basically you can just uh search into our um, browser mixmamo.com and uh, mix mamo allowed to us upload our own character also and here you can see if you don't have any character you want to practice with mix mamo so mix mamo also uh, give lots of character for doing practice also here you can see but right now we have our own character so it doesn't matter we don't need uh, those characters we'll upload our own so i'm just going to click upload character and open a new window and it will ask us if you have a fbx or obj and zip you can just import it basically yeah you can just import it so i'm just going to select the character file i'll just select this man one and open it so first time it will take a time little bit because it's also depend your internet connection and also how much heavier your file okay so it's depend of two things okay it depends on two things how much uh, like yeah my, my file is not heavier basically so it is open okay and one more thing i just want to tell you guys because what happened exactly when you are importing your uh, character from blender to into the mix mamo what happened exactly sometimes you might be lose your texture as you can see same i have also lose my textures but doesn't matter we can retain all those textures again when we will import this file from uh, basically when we will import this file again into the blender basically okay so don't worry i'm just gonna click on next button and here you can see here we have uh, some uh, basically controllers which is we have to place it if you don't know where we have to place uh, which one so there is a little bit infographic where you can see basically which controller we're supposed to be placed so and here you can see there is a name also i'm just gonna click it and drag it place it into the chin yeah this is one chin second one is like a wrist i'm just gonna place it here third one is elbow this is here fourth one is knees i'm just going to place it here and last it is groom i'm just going to place it here yeah everything is good to go then we have to just click it next and this process will take less than two minutes sometimes it's not take more than one minute but it depends again also your character file size and character mesh also if you have a high poly mesh it might be take more than two minutes but sometimes it's uh definitely complete within a minute basically okay so i think uh yeah it is almost done in my thought basically what happened exactly right now here it is auto rigging our whole character okay basically we have placed all controllers uh as you have seen before so now it is creating a automatic rig for us now here you can see i think everything is done yeah now here you can see it has definitely did uh, their good job now we have to click it next and again next yeah now here you can see guys we have a lots of animation here whatever animation we will click it it will shown in our character now for example if we need uh, this one jumping down so now here you can see yeah this is cool by the way here you can see all right now, like for example we need a reaction so it will react like oh now this is cool by the way okay if we need uh, like this one it will react like this wow this is so nice so right now what i'm gonna do basically i'm just gonna click a walk 
and I'll enter it. So there are lots of walk basically. So I need uh, this walk basically. OLEDs and this walk is look nice to me. This is nice OLEDs, but there are some options basically. What we can do, you can uh, increase the arm space. Okay, you can also trim the frame basically. But I think everything is good to go for me right now. So I'm not going doing any changes here. And uh, one more thing we can do it basically. Here you can see right now it is moving from one place to another place. But if you want your animation should be in a, in in place. So if you will just click this one, so it will only walk in place. It will not move anywhere. Okay, but we need a moving. So that's why I'm I don't I am I'm just unchecking this option. Okay, now everything is good to go. Now what what we have to do? We have to just download this file, and here it is asking basically you need with skin and without skin basically. So so what we can do here basically with skin you will get the uh, whole character, and if you not uh, if you click the without skin you will get only skeleton. So we need a with skin right now in a BX format 30 frames and. We don't need any frame keyframe reduction basically okay just download it okay it will take a little bit time for download and when everything will good to go it will ask for a way we need to download so we need basically here yeah i'm just gonna download it yeah everything is good okay now here you can see we have a walking abx here now what i will do i will again go to my blender all right and now here you can see we are in our blender now what i'm gonna do i'm just gonna import that same abx walking abx basically which is we have downloaded this one and I'm just going to import it. Now here you can see we have a uh, walking. Okay. If I'm just going to play the animation, you can see we have a good animation here. Now what I have told you before, when we will upload our character from Blender to Mixmamo, that might be you lose your uh, textures. But there is one option. What we can do basically, we can select our model. This model, I'll just do Control L and Link Material. We'll get our texture back. See very cool control l link material control l link material all texture you will get back see we need an eyes our eyes texture also control l link material yeah, I think we forgot to select second one. Link material. Yeah. Now here you can see we have a same texture with animation also. Now it's look nice by the way. So that's how you can use a mix mama for creating animation for into your uh, character. Okay, you don't need to do anything manually. You have to just export your model, import into mix mama, choose whatever animation you want in your character, then import again, download the same animation file and just do copy paste the textures and now here you can see this is the final result all right guys so that's how you can use it mix mamo and that's very easy and cool trick so i thought i should share it with you guys i hope you enjoyed this video you learn something new today if you learn something new please hit the like button the share button and subscribe my channel also if you have any queries or sensation please let me know in the comment box i'll definitely reply comment so bye bye take care and stay home guys